Hello and welcome to Let's Talk Meshing's Tutorial Tuesday where we explore a feature in just a couple of minutes. Today we're going to learn how to execute a script. To help automate common tasks, a scripting language called Glyph is included with Pointwise. The files themselves have a .glf file name extension. In this example, I'm going to run a script called Fillet and you can download it for free from github.com slash pointwise. This particular script is going to take the curved connector that you see and create the necessary structured domains to help our topology deal with this region. Most importantly, it's going to use the OH topology that will avoid the creation of pole connectors. Let's execute the script from the GUI. First go to Script, Execute, select the script file called fillet.glf, push Open. After a few seconds we will get some instructions up here. It says, please select fillet connectors. I'm going to go ahead and select the curved region here. And voila! In addition to executing the scripts from the GUI, you can also execute some scripts from the command line. Let's imagine I have a script called initdomains.glf that simply initializes all the domains that you see here and then exports them to a CGNS file. I can run that script from the command line. For Windows, it uses a tickle shell. So to run that script, open up the DOS prompt and type in the command starting with TCLSH and then you have to tell it where the script is. C, in this case C slash temp slash scripts slash init domains dot GLF push enter. Now what happened was the script ran, it opened the file, it created those three domains that you were, saw it selected them and it exported them to a .cgns file. Here's a summary of what the command line executables look like for the main operating systems. First we see the Windows and then Linux and then finally Mac OS X. If you find yourself running the script, same script all the time you can get to it really fast by going to the script menu and selecting re-execute. If you like this video, be sure to check the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.